In today's video, we'll take a look at Queen Elizabeth's frugal habits, like wearing a $10 nail polish and reusing bedsheets as cushion covers, using only six of the 775 rooms in her massive palace. In an interview with Hello Magazine, the Queen occupies only six of the hundreds of bedrooms at Buckingham Palace. She occupies only her bedroom, dressing room, bathroom, her private sitting room, the Empire Room, and the Audience Room where the Queen meets guests that include dignitaries. Having a modest diet, despite her wealth and capacity to eat any luxurious meals that her heart desires, she is not a foodie. Surprisingly, she's known for her simple diet that consists of vegetables, salads, and fish, and doesn't really mind using modest tables and kitchenware. A former chef at the palace told CNN how Her Majesty is disciplined to her diet. She prefers poached or grilled fish and vegetables. The queen is okay with her kitchen staff using simple, old pots and pans, which can be dated as far back as the 1800s and that have the stamp of Queen Victoria on them. The queen isn't bothered about food, but cares about her pets, including her dogs and horses. Keeping a close watch on energy consumption, her royal highness is also mindful of the palace's energy consumption. She's taken different measures to ensure that energy consumption is made wise. She roams the corridors of the palace and has been seen switching off the lights when they're not in use. One of the Buckingham Palace employees revealed that the queen told her staff to turn off unnecessary lights. The queen also put up signs throughout her residences to remind her staff of the importance of energy saving. Also according to the showbiz cheat sheet, the palace has an estimated number of 40,000 lights. Thus, the queen decided to ban the use of bulbs with more than 40 watts. Eating a simple breakfast. Perhaps, people assume that the queen eats the most impressive breakfast of smoked salmon, poached eggs, pastries, and exotic fruits, but not. The queen is not a foodie, who doesn't bother much about what to eat. She has her frugal choices for breakfasts and she knows what she likes. She pours herself a bowl of cereal like Special K or cornflakes that is kept fresh in a Tupperware or plastic container and eats it with some fruits. She eats her breakfast at 8.30 am daily with husband Prince Philip. But she also has one favorite habit before having her breakfast. When she's awake, she enjoys having a pot of her Earl Grey tea with some biscuits. She is also very particular about not having sugar for her tea because she doesn't want to consume any hidden calories. However, she doesn't mind adding some milk into it too. Recycling her outfits. The queen is also known for wearing the same outfit for at least one official event, and she's not shy about it. She recycles her clothes and people would see her wearing the same ensembles at least once. There can be some changes made on the clothing pieces so that they'll look a bit different. Her staff has a log of the clothes she wears. Each piece is named and described carefully on a spreadsheet so that she won't be wearing the same color or same outfit close together when on her official duties. For example, the yellow and turquoise ensemble she wore in 1997 in India was only worn after two years when she visited South Korea. Then, the queen didn't wear it again until only at the polo at the Windsor Great Park in 2003. Prefers repairing over replacing. Instead of replacing items, the queen is known for her inclination on repairing items even if she has a lot of money. She is against wastefulness, and if something can still be repaired, it shouldn't be thrown away. And instead of buying or ordering new ones, she wants them washed and mended. The same applies to her gloves from 40 years ago. A lot of people might perceive that the queen would easily toss worn out gloves, but she doesn't. She still has pairs of those. She keeps using her old pieces until they are no longer useful. Now if she doesn't want some clothes anymore, she gives them away instead of throwing them away. Wearing the same shoes over and over. Her Majesty has a practical 2 and 1 4 inch heel that she's always wearing. She has been consistent with this style in over 50 years, wearing the same shoes over again. Instead of buying new shoes all the time, the Queen wants her practical heel repaired. She gets them re-heeled instead. And if ever she buys a new pair of shoes, she asked her staff to wear and break them in to avoid feet sore. Not buying the most expensive handbags. She prefers her simple handbags that she's never seen in public without carrying one in her arm. She owns lawner bags, which prices start at 1,000 US dollars. And she doesn't also buy new luggage each time she flies, but maybe once a decade. 
The queen also doesn't let go of something she really likes. For instance, Her Majesty apparently is still using Globetrotter suitcases, which she first had for her honeymoon in 1947. Grocery shopping. She's been to a grocery or supermarket and has made an appearance at Waitrose for an October 2016 event. The Queen had the palace to switch their Christmas pudding suppliers. So from Harrods, an expensive upscale London department store, she had her palace switched to Tesco, a more affordable grocery store. Wearing a $10 nail polish, the Queen keeps her beauty and fashion simple. She's using Essie's Ballet Slippers nail polish that costs less than 10 US dollars. According to Glamour magazine, her hairdresser requested for a no-nail polish shade because she doesn't prefer colored nails that much. The queen instantly made the Essie's Ballet slippers blush a staple. Reusing bedsheets and turning them into cushion covers. The queen reuses her bedsheets instead of throwing them away. According to Adam Hellecker, the queen is known for her habit of extending her bedsheets lifespan. He revealed that Her Royal Highness continues to put old bedsheets into good use. She recycles bedspreads that she got from the former Royal Yacht Britannia that was decommissioned in 1997. Biographer Kate Williams said that the Queen has had the habit of reusing and recycling since she's young. She revealed how the Queen always reuses old gift wrapping papers and ribbons once Christmas is over, smoothening them out for storage. She added that the Queen prefers that the members of the royal family give gifts with practical uses such as ironing boards and kettles. And speaking of the royal family, they have been reported to be frugal too, with one royal even saving leftovers after a meal. Find out more in this next video on how the royal family lives frugally.